Hey everyone, welcome back. Saints Wolf here, back at it again with a little bit more RimWorld. Where we last left off, not much occurred. We had one little raid that, you know, pokey point to some of our boys. You know. You have a major infection in your left leg. Who tended it last time? Yeah, you'll be fine. And then we have Mule over here who also has a little bit of hypothermia. Because he's not wearing any form of clothing. But he's gonna go wear a jacket right now, so hopefully that should assist. Birds are back at it, guys. I'm sorry. I did attempt to uh, put something in the cage to get them to be quiet, but they seem unfazed. So I hope they aren't as loud to you guys as they normally are, but I can't, you know, really say anything for that. Yeah, no. I'd rather have Gray do this, even though Mule, I'm pretty sure you're a decent doctor. You're an okay doctor. But Gray has a level 9 doctor, and I want to make sure he lives. So there we go. Oh, he would have lived even if I didn't treat him. <laughs> there we go. What? No. I mean, they definitely do have a place to go. It's called over here, so... Stop lying. Oh, you know what? Predator. You know, this is just... No. Now, here's the difficulty with this, right? Let me go ahead and do one of these, guys. We're gonna get another. We're gonna get another zone out. Clear. One hundred. Allow all apparel except for clean apparel. Critical. There we go. They now have a place to be. Let's see how are our trees growing? They're not. They are not growing at all. To be expected, I guess. We have some heal root grow grown over here. Before this dies off, let's harvest it. No, actually, is there anything else we can really harvest before it dies off? Because I'd like harvest it all. What in the? Oh, okay. I am the walrus. Cuckoo, cachoo. Okay, that's it. Probably more on the map, but you know. Sorry, but when it's moving sideways from very far scrolled out, you do not look like a walrus. Help wanted. There are fields of blah 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 blah. Send help with capable growers. Where is it? That's my biggest question. If it's nearby, I don't mind doing it, but if it's going to take any more than a day to travel there. Okay, no, stop, stop. Ooh, there we go. Yeah, that's definitely not to be messed with right this moment. Probably later, though. We can most certainly do such a thing. How's our streamlined arrows looking? 75. He's gonna make some more. Let's go, Toy Boy. You're now our crafter rather than anything else. Antisocial Gray. Everyone wants to be antisocial right now, or histonic, or in some way, shape, or form in need of some form of social attention. Weasel is still recovering, but he'll forever be missing his toe. Yep. Unless, of course, we eventually replace it with Bionic. I mean, he lives that long. Baloo, when you wake... You know what, Weasel? You have all the time in the world to sleep. I'm sure you probably aren't even tired. Yeah, there you go. Woohoo. Take over. Hey, hey, pardon me. Weasel, fire keep. Fully healed. Wonderful. You're okay, you're trying to calm Grey down. That would be beneficial. Before a raid occurs and she gets ganked and kidnapped and now we're down another person. You are our primary warden, right? Yes, you indeed are. Wait, Weasel. Weasel. Hold on a minute. You, you didn't even try. You just kind of looked at her and was like, eh, no hope. Probably fail. Yep. 
Most certainly. Where are we? Okay, there we are. We almost have those, not built, but resources delivered. That's nice. Oh, there we are. We're toy poise, or mule, rather. <laughs> Just building those. Let's see. Plunk, plunk, plunk. Reinstall. Whoever gets them, gets them. We'll give mule at least a chance. I deleted everyone's bed but his, so there we go. An Ibex doe self-tamed, cargo pods. Randy must feel bad. I don't really need this Ibex dough, so we're gonna... There we go. <clears throat> that should do it. Blue should be coming over here any moment to go ahead and slaughter that Ibex dough for us. There she goes. Slaughtered. Rest in peace, Ibex, though. Luckily, because it's so cold here, all this is actually refrigerated. It will not spoil. Which is nice. In here, I'm trying to make sure this stays nice and warm, thankfully. Exhaustion, starvation, well, gray. Maybe if... You were okay. I can't right click on you. Maybe if you weren't in a mental break, you wouldn't be having an issue. Did you ever think of that? Nah. Okay. Hey, Weasel has a bed. Can't wait for this to be done. It's almost there. Cause afterwards we're gonna shoot for all this. I'm thinking. Gray is collapsed due to exhaustion. You know, I do... It is unfortunate. I don't, I'm not a big fan of cloth, but I do need at least a small grow zone of it. Make a small little 5x5 five five of cloth. Not that it will be planted anytime soon, but... Elephant leather. Nah, you know what, Randy? That, that hurts, okay, man? That hurts. What is this? You want 17 night? Oh. <laughs> you know, if I could use power at this moment, maybe. Maybe. But there's no such thing as power in my colony. Therefore, no. Wrong thing. Bunch of bison live. Let's see. Any? No. I murdered all the elk. Weasel. Nice. Let's see, what could be the next thing we get? Basic prosthetics. Eh. I'm thinking probably more along the lines of just a basic agriculture, be able to plant more crops. That's nice because now we can come over here, go production with a stone cutter's bench. It's not a very big area to do any form of crafting. <laughs> Didn't need it to be massive though. I'll probably have multiple of them. Why not? Because I, I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that. I started talking and then that was that. Is the marsh at least pretty? No, the marsh isn't very pretty. If it was over here, it at least would have no negative effects, but, well, we will have to accept it for what it is. Nice job! You killed it. Boy, boy, your crafting's still terrible. I was say, why aren't you crafting, or cooking, rather? Not that difficult. Uh, animals, you're not forced to be in there. No, you're not. You're just in there because you can be.
Nice, so we got a decent bit of wood stockpiled too. Oh, there we go. This is all done. Go hygiene. Oh, you know what? This is probably built. Yeah, I should have built it out of steel, but I kind of numbed that. Let's see. Let's make granite blocks. Not do forever. Do until marble blocks. Do until sandstone blocks. Do until this. We're going to go and satisfy at 200. No, no, well, hold on. 200. And 200. Punk. There we are. Hmm. What I'm thinking all of a sudden is we go ahead and. Hmm. Right, we do something like that. One, two, three. I hate that you have to do it like that. Four. You can go ahead and be. Steel slag. You can go ahead and be granite. You can go ahead and be marble. And I didn't even. And you can go ahead and be sandstone. There we go. So now when things like this get hauled. You know, most of it will go here, but when we don't have this over here, that's where that will go. They... Pretty good. You're great. We're doing all that work. Here we are. Okay. We'll we'll just ignore that. Hey birds, if you wouldn't be so kind to be quiet. I think it worked. For now, of course. Soon they'll realize, hey, wait a minute, and that will occur. Right there. That exact thing will occur. Wonderful. Let's see, toy po oh, not toy boy, mule, if you don't have anything else to do, you can be mining. Alright, and then over here, let's go ahead and we'll make all this out of marble for now. You know, do we? Hmm. Yeah, we'll make it out of marble. Well, uh, no, we'll just make it out of steel, because all this will eventually be taken away. Anyways, marriage is on. That would mean that... Who is that? Toy Poi and Gray are getting married. Miscellaneous. Marriage spot. Um. <laughs> Have everyone stand in the swamp except for those getting married. That'll do it. Gray told Toy Poi that she wants to spend her life with him. Toy Poi agreed, and the two are now engaged. At some point in the coming days at Quadrums, they will have their marriage ceremony and invite all the colonists. Consider placing a marriage spot if you want to control where the ceremony occurs. N a failed golf club, but you know. I would love to, you know, insert this into some colonist somewhere, but... I want Blue to be my animal manager over my scientist, so we get to wait for that. Weasel, what are you currently doing? Cooking four fine meals. Got it. I appreciate. It's September. It's not even winter yet, guys. It's still fall. Ain't that crazy. This is looking real nice to be able to have all of this. We won't be using it for some time, but eventually we will. Eventually.
Who didn't get the bed, by the way? You got it, Weasel, Cray, and Toy Boy. Blue, that's... Hold on. Sure, if I hunt an Ibex Ram, although we have no need for it. Pretty. Nice. Gray's going around, chopping down all these trees. Which is really nice. Diplomatic marriage. Word of Mule's charm has reached Zario, and they've asked you for Mule's hand in marriage. Accepting this marriage proposal will cement relation and strengthen faction ties. But Mule will leave your faction to join the White Desert. No, that might be Desert. Hold on. Yeah, Desert Tribe. Reject. Oh, wow. They really didn't like that. My monitor makes it hard to read small fine ticks, and that's exactly what I had to do right there, so, you know. Thumbs up. Ooh, we got some muffalo wool. Oh, you know what that means? That should mean I can come over here and go muffalo wool double bed. It's no. Alright, do you have hypothermia? You'll. When you wake up, please build that. Everyone has hypothermia slightly. Alright, looks like I'm gonna have to come over here and go campfire. This one campfire is obviously not enough to keep that going. So. Fun. At least during the night it gets a chance to heat up, but it's definitely still below freezing. There we go. Punk. My bad. Not what I meant to do there, really. And get that reinstalled there. This should heat up. Alright, go ahead and build this, please. <clears throat> there we are. This should really start to heat up now. You know, assuming this door doesn't keep getting opened. This will, you know, warm up, but I don't need it to be as warm as the bedrooms where people sleep, so. Winter is almost here. Can you believe it? More muffalo wool. Let's go and haul that away. <clears throat> we'll go ahead and deconstruct that. And place another one so that way Blue sleeps in the other bed. Ooh, Mega Sloth. Hi. It was going. Hi. Have a good time. You gonna go eat a tree? No, he might just be leaving the map. Yep, that's exactly what he's doing. He's gonna go ahead and leave the map. Punk. To be expected. Oh, look at that. Speaking of Toy Boy. We let him feel special. <laughs> i gonna butcher real quick, see if kind of food we get. There we go. There we go. Yeah, see, it's nice and warm in there now. Don't tell me this is gonna be raided. No, it's a Vulcan trader. And there's a relationship within this trader. Sister of member Mule. Your mule's sister? No. It was like thunder something or something, 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 something. Um. Why don't we. Click, click, click. What? I see like ugly or something. Disfigured. Wonderful. Oh, hello. Oh. What in the world? Oh, you know what? Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> Ah, oh, there we go. Now, if I go guest... Ah, uh, you're a caravan, not a guest, so I can't recruit you. Unfortunate. I'm gonna have Weasel come talk to this dude. He's our best talk... Ooh, they have huskies. Be very beneficial to be able to have one of them.
Let's see, you have a male and a female husky. What do I have to trade to be able to get that? You can have all of that, and that will pay for both huskies. So... <laughs> oh, you know what, you can also have this duster, these pants, this button-down shirt. You can have all of the clothing. We need none of it. Unless, of course, now let's take a peek. Are any of you selling... Well, are you in general... Selling a parka. If they are, I don't see it. Unfortunate. Oh wait, you know what? We don't need synth red. We don't need eel skin. Get rid of this elephant leather. We only have three herbal medication. I think we should... Oh wait, no, we have 55 right there. Never mind. Uh, we'll also give you the elk if we're going to get two huskies out of this. And I think that oh, we need to buy some things. Let's buy a little bit of their wood, yeah? Let's buy, like, 200. Okay, let's buy about 300 and, yeah, 21. Except. Now, we now have two huskies. Bloop, 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 bloop. Yeah, you guys are unrestricted. That's fine. Where did all of... Well, here, let's just do one of these. Click. We should now have 900 wood on the whole map. Nice! Alrighty, guys. That's all I have time for for this episode. We made it to winter. Hopefully we'll... Well, we should survive this. I don't see why we shouldn't. We have plenty of food. We now have the huskies. We have some muffalos. So, all in all, today has been a good day for this. But... I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and as always, I'll see you next time.